Let's simplify the fraction 18 81st. So what we want to do, find another fraction that's equivalent. It's equal to 18 divided by 81. It's just that we've reduced it or simplified it down to its lowest terms. To do that, we need to find a common factor, something that goes into 18 and then 81 evenly. These are the factors for 18 and 81. So for 18 and 81, when we look at these factors, we're looking for the greatest common factor. And it looks like 9, that's going to be the greatest common factor. It goes into 18 and 81. So let's divide 18 by 9, then 81 by 9, and we'll have simplified the fraction 18 over 81. Let's move these over here. So 18 divided by 9, that gives us 2. And then 81 divided by 9, that gives us 9. And we've simplified the fraction 18 81sts down to 2 9ths. And we can't simplify this any further. If you divide 18 by 81 or 2 by 9, you'll get the same decimal value. They're equivalent fractions. It's just that we simplified 18 81sts down to 2 9ths. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.